Now, ladies and gentlemen, especially for the men out there, we hate to reduce sometimes to the lowest common denominator, but we are not one to ignore the statistics. And the statistics have said that men across the board, no matter whether you adjust for age or religion, all respond to sexual ads. Did you know that? Whether you look at Amish, yes. black, white, brown, red, 12, 60, they all respond to sex. <laughs> I don't know why. Some just respond a little bit slower. But so here, I guess, I wanted to say, I say that because we have to prepare people for our guests. As we say, Tuesday's Girls Vic, right? Yes, sir. So much more than eye candy. Yes, uh, sir. A personality, uh, and, uh, a representative for every situation, right? And, and more than just beauty, man, because every time we get surprised by the wealth and background that they have, it's, it's easily to go, you know, to get... Get taken advantage of because of your beauty, but take it advantage is. of me, please. We get, we try to get into their, their backgrounds, too, using our stalker skills. <laughs> <You're> wrong, <laughs> <man. Hold on>. <laughs> <laughs> get wrong, man. Wonderful stalking skills. Well, first of all, and Natasha, see, now, Natasha, now, Natasha, she's, we're going how, how young folks are. So now she's Natasha Mia, but I'm just teased a little bit. But take a look, ladies and gentlemen, sipping and schmoozing. How this you is where we blush? meet, I guess. Take a look. Wow. There you are. Wow, snap. wow, wow, wow. Okay. Now, if you feel free to comment as we expose you. <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay. The eyes, the eyes tell no lies. No, no that's the one. That looks yeah, gangster. Amazing. That looks mm. like she's about to, I'm not going to say anything. Well, I don't, don't leave it alone. Yeah. Now, you got to tell us, okay. Huh? What was, the, well, basis? Well, what was the basis for the shots? You know, those photos. It was just a hot photographer, you know. He knows what he's doing, and he got me hot and heavy, and that's that's where he got to, you know. Wow, wow, okay. Did some amazing work. Take a Did look. Some amazing work. Take a look, everybody. Look up close now, and we gonna have some hot pics later on. Now we're gonna we're gonna sip and smooth, but first I wanted to titillate you. Here's Shayna. We have that one now, and we have some different things we could show. <laughs> Oh, there she comes. <laughs> Miss Valdez is in the, his house. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Valdez is here. Please clap. All right. The announcement. There you go. We're good. That's right. So now the, we know, we told them, we, we got the message, don't pay the ransom that you had escaped. And girl, you look good. <laughs> Thank you. You look good for all that, all that travel. Yes. Welcome. I'm Mario. Welcome. Thank you. And that's Victor. Hello. And I don't know if you know you Shayna and yes. Natasha. Thank you too. Hi. Ladies and gentlemen, we are complete. Now, so okay, well, let's okay. We're so we were showing Shana's picture, and we can, we got we're gonna have a chance to smooth and meet all our guests. And we have here's a there's a video from Shana too. Interesting. Then, but here we also have I guess that just Wonder Woman. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> that's hot. That is looking hot. hot all right, <laughs> Wonder Woman, and then that's Miss Erica Valdez. Everybody. <laughs> wow. <laughs> all right, all right. We got to find out about you, ladies. Come on now. This in the sipping and schmoozing segment, we we try to get to know our guests, and we're a little overwhelmed. I have to take you know a moment today. I did do my workout this morning, Victor. No, you feel good right I now. Do. I do. Oh. I gotta, we got to find out about you guys. Well, Who's gonna go for who? Okay, I'll leave you. Who wants to go first? Oh, I just hear like you said. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have to find out. Okay, since. Since Erica walked in late, let's put her on the spot and find out about her. Because Erica, now tell us about you, you Erica. You are one of the, our live hot picks for the day. And Thank we know you. that you're always so much more than eye candy. You missed that part. I was saying how the Tuesdays <laughs> girls are so much more than eye candy, not just beauty. But when you get to know them, they always have something going on. Mm -hmm. And usually they have a good credit rating. <laughs> <laughs> Some money saved away. They often have very, very involved family who are also accomplished. So now tell us a little bit about yourself. What would you, and, and pimp this video. Okay. So um, tell them, tell our audience, because right now they're, big. what camera sh should she speak to? As she's she looking right at it right now. It's over her left shoulder. Oh. And it's, it's, it's pointing straight in her face. So oh, she's that good. one right there. Yeah, then. right here. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's her. So tell our little audience about... Uh, me? Yes. I'm from Key West, Florida, and I've okay. been living in Los Angeles for about five years, and I'm a writer, model, and actress. Hopefully, you'll be the new Wonder Woman in the feature film, Ching Ching. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now, wait, so you, does that mean that you're in the comic books? 
No, but I, okay, I you just walk. Okay, <laughs> so Key West. Mm-hmm. Wow, that's a cultural shock to go. I've been to Key West. I took that drive. If I drove down playing that Chuck Key, you know that smooth operator track, I kept bumping. <laughs> well, I drove down. You know, I did that drive on that long bridge that goes across the water. Mm-hmm. But it's such a cult. That's yes, so well. different from Los Angeles. Yes, it is very, very different. But um, I love to travel, so I just recently got back from Italy about three weeks ago. Oh, how'd you like that? I loved it. I was there. I went to France, um, all over France and Italy. Okay. Well, see, now I love Italy and the women. I, and then it's funny, but that whole dark-haired women. Even though Vic, I, it's the <clears> thing <throat> with the the most beautiful women, and they went. She went to hail a cab, and boom, she has. They have all that hair. You just had to go there. You just had, I can't believe you had to go there. Well, I'm just saying, when you travel abroad, you notice that everybody's not like Americans. It's not that you even hold it against them. I kind of appreciate it. It wasn't a big deal to me. Right. I've been a very, very hot, uh, excuse me, Albanian man, actually. Will he be able to hear this interview? Yes, he could be, he could be watching you right now. Because you're live on the internet right oh, now. Awesome. Yeah, he's, he's, that was a big highlight of the trip. But... Um, my goals are to really um, become a full-time book author and hopefully raise enough money on my own to donate uh, to schools around the world that can't afford their own libraries or build libraries through my writing. Oh, wow. That's, so not only do you want to be successful, you got plans to what to do with it once you make the money. What kind of stuff do you want to write? Nonfiction and fiction. I've written a children's book. and um, some. I wrote a book called The Book of Bitches. It's how to identify a bitch when you meet one, how to handle he or she, and most importantly, how to manifest your inner bitch so you don't get run over by bitches out there. Wow. Okay, wait. <laughs> okay, wait. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. 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 Okay. Wait. Is that was that part of the Bible? Yeah, I, don't like, I like I how to identify bitches. Yeah, it's something you know, and, and I must admit that's helpful today, even though today. A lot of bitches self-identify. They even wear bitch-identifying clothes. They say, like, bitch, I'm a bitch, be my bitch, you know. And even some of the names on the Internet, people, when they write you, you know, they have very interesting names. Mm-hmm. And so that's it. What, so what made you, you obviously ran into some bitches. High school probably, yes, no doubt. Yes, usually, yeah. I, is that not where we run into the, I, you know, usually not in junior high. But by high school, something about high school makes the bitch come out of people. It's true. Men too. They start being <laughs> bitch and all of them. So, so what made you uh, hit that topic? Just, um, yes, just growing up with everybody knows somebody who's a bitch. And just because people are acting like a bitch doesn't mean that they are one. It's a temporary personality malfunction. So that's why I try to explain to my readers that we can break <laughs> oh, everyone. I love it's that. It's personality malfunction. <laughs> yes. No, but Erica, I agree because I I, people have said that I, me, perhaps, <laughs> no. have been quite a little bitchy. You know, I have been. <laughs> it has been a reference. Yes, there's, yeah, and there's so many different types of bitches embedded in people, you know. It's just mm-hmm. that you can't give up on people at all. Well, I Just guess. understand that's just a temporary malfunction problem, and you work through it if that person's really important. The only person, the only type of bitch that really can't be transcended is a player hater, and that's somebody who's very jealous of everybody else, and they just have no hope in life. So, you don't, but meet you halfway, bitches, on the job, bitches. Jack in the box bitches are people who you think are cool and then they catch you by surprise and they're a bitch. I'm going to have to get this book. You got to come back and promo this. And we can talk about that for a while. That's wonderful. We got to. Uh, it's, like it's like when Borat says, you know, he's buying a car in the movie and he says, yeah. <laughs> he says he needs a pussy magnet. Like, I feel like I have a bitch magnet, you know, <laughs> in my car. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm in heaven. I just had a woman say bitch and the other one say pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Shayna, your turn. I gotta catch up. <laughs> 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 All right. <laughs> All right. Well, let's let's now let's smooth with. Okay, let's find out now, Shayna. <laughs> Churchfield, <laughs> Miss Churchfield, come I, on. I, right off the bat, I already have a mini qualm here. These ladies have beautiful photos that you're showing all them, and you, the only thing of me is me to wig. You know, you all got your nerve. <laughs> like, like, you know, that's what, what y'all that? sent me. That's what they sent me. I'm going to go to your, okay? I got the four. Did you want them photos? They didn't, right. for, hey, this was, I got, cause I, and I, I did get sent this, uh, uh, this video. Oh, see. What's this YouTube video? <laughs> Are we going to get slammed by the, for having a Lady Gaga? Are you in the, Huh? <laughs> what is this? We were sent this. Oh, oh that's you. Oh, yeah, this is a school project. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Is that you? Yeah. Oh, my gosh, that's so awesome. It looks hot. Oh, I love 
I love Where's it. Where's the audio on Yeah. This? Oh, no. So you're in. This is hysterical. That yeah. is. I had to do wow. a commercial. And actually, my degree's in editing. Oh, that's, that's, so we got to back this bad boy. Oh, yeah. Come on. Let's see it slow motion. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Oh, that's great. Oh, no. Oh, girl. <laughs> I'm going to let that make up for my lack of obscene words. <laughs> you get videos. <laughs> we all going to see a little bit of something. Oh, my God. Shayna. Oh, God. This is hilarious. Yay! 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 All right. Okay. All right. All right. Now, okay. Like I said, remember I told you guys more than eye candy? All right. Explain yourself, girlfriend. Uh, well, I was... Last semester of school, I've actually I went to school for editing, and we were doing a little project. And so wait, 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 wait. She went to school, and see, I always have to see, remember. I told you guys, I told you. <laughs> see, you better you we take them out, be prepared, steady up. So she went to school for editing. For film editing, yes. Thank you. Yeah, all right, um, that's all right, yeah, it is. Yeah, that's that's powerful. That's Boy, I told you, go on. The kids in the class didn't know that I, it was like a, a one-on-one class. It was it just happened in my last semester of school, and they were doing some like play up front, and I was busy, so they I told them I'd do the commercials, the commercial breaks, and that was one of two wow. Lady Gaga commercials. We well, you guys, see, see, you know what, see, you know what's so interesting. So far, everybody here is right for internet television because what we're doing is pioneering. It's revolutionary. But these are the type of individuals you can't get them on regular mm -hmm. TV. No. You can't get them, so you're gonna need to come to internet television. <laughs> you know, I have to throw that plug out there because I want everybody out there thinking about having an internet television channel and doing their own thing. Yeah. So tell us about your, a little bit more about your background. Where did you grow up? I grew up in Phoenix, Arizona. Wow, so yeah, that's how, how you survived. Uh, it's air I, the snakes and all. I had <laughs> oven mitts in my car. So how do you guys take that dry. heat? I mean, yeah. so they, it is hot. It's hot. It is very hot. But it's dry, and that's supposed to make up for it, but I don't I don't agree. It's hot. I think the people are just tough. I know people who live there and you know, other places that are hot, and I don't know how they do it. I say yeah. more power to you. But yeah, so Phoenix, Arizona, Phoenix, Arizona okay. Arizona, I moved here about a month ago. It was oh, a 122 month ago. degrees at 10 p.m. at night while I'm packing my car to come over it. Wow. And then I got here, and it's like 85, and people were complaining. Going. Oh, there they do. Well, why did you come? What made you come? Uh, to act. act. So this was like the traditional take it upon yourself to... Pack up the car and go kind of thing, yeah. So. What did your family say? My mom's bummed. She She's one of my closest friends. So she's actually the closest person to me. But, you know, they both get it. You know, well, I hope mom, mom, and it. we love moms here. We love moms. I'm a mama's boy. I ain't lying. Um, I get, mine gets a check I, every month. I actually have to text or call my mother every morning so she knows I'm alive. There you go. So <laughs> say, so mom. By and like we, noon, she's freaking out. We're going to try to make sure we, 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 we represent. So now that you're here, you've been here for a month, what are your plans? Ma, I, I'm still working on that. I have a job, which is nice. <laughs> Yeah. Helpful. Well, you already are internet television. You've been here a month. Internet television. So, yeah, we're good. I mean, I just, finding an agent, start getting started, you know. Well, remember, we tell all our guests, pimp this video. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. as we go through this show, we're going to be talking about different things. And they're going to get the, we, and obviously, as you can see, it's going to be some interesting <laughs> opinions. But now.